Meghan gives update on Lily and Archie dash it'll only get more chaotic. The Duchess of Sussex said she's in the thick of it with her little ones and revealed Lilibet has just started walking. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are bringing up their two children, Archie and Lilibet, in the leafy town of Montecito, California, with the couple working from home in order to have as much time with their youngsters as possible. Meghan Markle, while discussing the pressures that come with being a good mom, wife or partner in a certain way on the eighth episode of her Spotify podcast series, Archetypes, gave some insight into their family's whirlwind morning routine and shared that Archie is now in preschool, and Lilibet, who is nicknamed Lily, has just started walking. As both her children can now walk with one-year-old Lilibet now toddling, Megan described herself as in the thick of it on the Good Wife, Bad Wife, Good Mom, Bad Mom episode of her podcast, released on November 1st, where she also spoke to First Lady of Canada, Sophie Gregory Trudeau. Speaking to Better Things writer and actress, Pamela Adlin, the Duchess of Sussex said, Lily has just started walking. She's a year and a couple of months old and Archie's just over three years old. So they are, oh, I'm in the thick of it. Doddling. Although she said she was in the thick of it now with their mornings already being a rush, Meghan acknowledged that it will only get more chaotic as her children get older. The former Suits actress morning routine is much like many households. Her day begins by getting up with Lily, adding that she uses baby monitors to listen to both of her youngsters. Once she gets up with Lily and gives her something to snack on, she begins making three-year-old Archie's lunchbox just before he wakes. Prince Harry, who she described as great, also mucks in helping bring Archie downstairs ready for them all to have breakfast together which the Duchess enjoys making herself. Meghan continued, I, get, Lily, downstairs, then a half hour later Archie's up, I, start doing his lunchbox right before he's up, while, getting, Lily, a little nibble. My husband's helping me get him downstairs. I make breakfast for all three of them, it's very important to me, I love doing it. And it just to me feels like the greatest way to start the morning. Megan then turns her attention to the couple's three pooches, a Labrador and two beagles named Guy Pula and Mila, who live with them in their pound 14 million mansion. She added, and then it's like feed all three of the dogs, because we just got another dog. Then get Archie out the door to school. But it feels like a whirlwind. Their pets are an important part of the Sussexes household as Harry described the couple as having five children in October. In a video call with the winners of Well Child Awards, Harry spoke to Isabel Delaney, winner of the Inspirational Young Person Aged 12 to 14 Award, who uses an assistance dog called Hope. Upon hearing about her dog, he said, I tell you what, we all need a dog that keeps us calm. I've got three in this house now. So. We basically have five children. Meghan and Harry have deliberately chosen to work from home and do so efficiently to ensure they can have as much time with their children as much as possible during their formative years. In an interview with Variety earlier this year, Meghan said, We share an office. We work from home, as most people started to do during lockdown. It allows us to have significant time with our kids at this really special moment in their lives. We'll never get this time back. I make breakfast, and we get the kids set for the day. We do a lot of joint calls and Zooms, but also try to divide what we can focus our energies on so we can accomplish even more. My husband is on a 24-hour time zone, where half of your life is waking up as the other half is going to sleep. It's kind of the reverse of what I went through living in the UK. He's very good at responding on text. Me. I try to be as fast as possible on email. I've always said, if it takes less than five minutes, do it now. In terms of the future and a career for her little ones, Meghan added that while her children are part of a legacy, tradition and family that will have other expectations, she said she wants her children to be able to carve out their own path and do something that brings them complete joy. For the time being. Meghan said she and Harry both feel joyful and are creating multi-dimensional, interesting, kind, creative people, adding that that is how she would describe her two little ones now.